Hey everyone, it is Hazel of Ice Hazelnut Channel coming to you with a teeny tiny coloring book haul <laughs> and I'm showing you what I've colored in the past, I'd say six months. So I have three new books, newish. This is from Salvation Army and it's a postcard coloring book. So I'll show you a few pictures from it. Just pause if you want a better look at them. I'm just going through this really fast. That's kind of cool. <laughs> so yeah, here's the back of it. Can't see if there's a retail price. I don't have my glasses on. One second, here it is. Retail for $9.99. So, yep, that's that. Next two are from Dollar Tree. So this one I bought like a month ago. David Bowie by Mel Elliott, retrospective and coloring book. And it also has a nice little placeholder ribbon. Here's the inside. It's from, it's copyright 2016. And I'm just gonna show you a few pictures. So on to the left is some verbiage and then the picture they're talking about the platform shoes he used in life on mars and his 1972 video of it and then that retailed for 16 but I found it at the Dollar Tree there's a <laughs> that's kind of cool it's like carved in there and copper like foil Alrighty. And then this I bought last week I found at the Dollar Tree again the alphabet coloring book and I'll go through a few pictures. This is by Renee Chin. Harper Design is a publisher. I'll just show you a few pics. So here's a little bit about the illustrator and the back of the book. And here, it retailed for $15.99, but I got it for a dollar. So decent book. So it's got letters, numbers, symbols, etc. So those are the three new books. Now I'm just going to show you what I've colored. Another new book, sorry. This one, it's the, I found this at Myers. I got it on clearance for 208. Justice League, 30 pages. Now I already colored one and gave it to my brother. He loves Superman. And I let my sister pick out some. So she has, she picked out two or three. So there's like four missing, at least four. So I colored this one real quick pencil um while I was babysitting that's the only one I've colored besides the Superman one and I'm just, these are and they came loose they're all loose I'm just going to show you a few Put this back over here that's a neat one that's cool and let's look at another one one more. Oh, I saw that one. There you go. Okay. Here's the back. In the back here, you, these are all the coloring pages that are in the book. I don't know how much it retails for. 
doesn't say on the back. But anyways. Yeah. That's a cool book. I can't remember where I bought this. It might have been the Dollar Tree. So I only I've only colored one. There's a free digital storybook. Didn't even see that. <laughs> so I colored this pencil and then it's the same basically the same picture and then I'll show you a few pages from the others there's some uh, puzzles in here too This retailed for $3.99. I'm pretty sure I got this at the Dollar Tree. If not, it was gifted to me. I really can't remember. Last year was a blur. So this one I've showed before what I've colored. And I finished this. This I just did brown or gray here because I think it looks cool just like that. finished oh it's double-sided I did this and then hey hey and a, uh, I forgot what they, these guys are called they're crazy that's all that's all I've done in this one and then I've previously shown what else I've colored but so far that's it in that book okay this one I can't remember where I left off, tell you the truth, so bear with me. You might have seen some already. I'll just thumb through them real quick. This is all marker, all the way that turned out very vibrant. Color, mostly color pencil. I did some in marker. We eat coffee for breakfast. I love this book. I love breakfast. <laughs> and donuts and muffins. This is a tea for tea, those teetotalers. Very cool. That one was... Oof. That one took me a while. <laughs> Another tea. Good morning. I think my nephew did this. Yeah, my nephew did this one. I think he did a pretty good job. And there's this one. Too much bacon, said no one ever. <laughs> I like that one. That one's cute. And it's got perforated, so you can tear them out easily. This one was white. My nephew. So, and that's is that where I left off. Yes, I'll show you a few more. That one's going to be cool to color. I'll just show you a couple more pictures. I'm almost done with this book. More eggs. That's it. There's a Christmas one. So I finished this one. I think in the last update on this book, I just had a little bit on the inside done. Then I finished it. Marker. Meh. It's meh. <laughs> Santa. Then I started, but oh no, I finished it. Yeah, I finished that. You can't tell, but it's got metallic. Maybe if I do this, there's a little metallic silver in the. And I started this one, but I haven't finished it. So there's some metallics. See in that. And that's where I left off.
I love this one too. This is one of my favorites. So I think I left off here. I was trying to guess. I didn't want to go back to the videos because too time consuming. <laughs> Did these chairs, colored pencil. Shelves with books. I love this one. Cakes, different cakes. If you want a longer look, just pause the video. I think I showed these, sorry, but that was April. I did that. A tart. <clears throat> Papaya. I oh, like the sh shish kebab. So, and there's that. I really like this one. I like the way it turned out too. Cakes and cupcakes, desserts. From Sweet Home. A dollhouse. It's pretty light. It's all in um, colored pencil. That's cute. That's cute for a baby's room. Plates and teacups. Oh, it's really light. I don't know if you guys can see the detail on that. And there's suggestions down here on the colors to use. Sometimes I follow it, sometimes I don't. <laughs> there's this petit sleeve. I think that's it. That's the last one I did. Yeah. And then it continues on with that, which I haven't done yet. I am, how far am I on this book? About halfway. Yeah, I'm about halfway on this book. That was from Michael's. Okay, let's see. My Buffy book. So I did this front. Is like the front cover, only it's a complete, complete one. I like the way that one turned out. So there's verbiage on this side of scenes from the show and tells you season two when she was bad episode, etc. Started this. I didn't finish the back. I need to finish the background on there. And that's where I left off. Yeah. Left off there. So I need to finish that page. I love this book. This is huge. <laughs> only done a couple pages. I did this one which I've shown before and I started this the shells. So I like to look look them up on like Google for reference and I try to find the same shape shell and go with the colors so I'll show you a few other pictures. This is a huge book. It's I think it's a 12 by 12. Okay. That was a Dollar Tree find too. My autumn book. I love autumn. I think this, I don't I think I've shown any of this book, but here they are. You see the metallics in that? This, this. Love the vibrancy of those colors. 
that's colored pencil and marker. There's a marker on these. The pumpkin. Squirrels. Here's some detail. This one. Colored pencil. There's some metallic colored pencil in there too. And that's it. Here's some gourds. I'll just show you a few pictures. I love fall. My favorite is winter, a second is fall. <laughs> There it is a neat tree. And one more. Oh, that's cool. Okay. And that's from that same um, company. They did a winter magic. Alright, let's see. I don't know if I've shown any of these, so I'll just show it the whole thing you I did the inside cover this was ready it was pre-printed get too much glare I really don't care for the mandala type but I still go with the flow mandala is it mandala I like the way this turned out That's very, you see that it's shiny? There's like a lot of metallic in there. Those are pens, metallic pens. And pen and pencil here. Used. Okay. I don't want to miss any pages. <laughs> that one was okay. Not my favorite. <laughs> I like this one. Some of that metallic pencil and pen. I use both metallic pens and pencils. And then this is just light. More metallics. I wasn't crazy about that one <laughs> or that one. See that? There's a the detail. This one. Ooh, that's bright. Bright red. I love the way this one turned out. This I use metallic pens. Look at that. work. <laughs> That's very pretty. <coughs> I 
Unfortunately, that green is from the other side. Let's see, that bled through. I can't remember which markers. I think it's obviously used marker, so I have to remember not to use marker on these. This is recent, and then I started this one, but I have not gotten any further. This is a new one to I started doing the inside cover but haven't finished. Oh if you can you can barely see that. That's colored pencil. Pretty light. I love using the metallic pens on these um, with a dark background. I love the way this one turned out. So I'll show you the whole image. There. I can give you a close up, see how metallic. Alex used there. And that's it for that. Here, wait, I'll show you a few other undone ones. Is that a beaver? Oh, that's interesting. Zebra. Why would you even do anything with a zebra? <laughs> Unless you wanted to make it pink. Or blue, the white part. Amush. And I'll switch for one more. Another owl. Very cool. Last book, my Star Wars book. Okay. Let's see. I'm trying to remember. Nothing past here. So I know I've showed this before. Mandalas again, not crazy about them, but I do them. Jar Jar Binks. <laughs> Give you a close up shot. This, I love the way this turned out. More mandala type, not my favorite. <laughs> As you can see, here's a great 3PO, C3PO. I'll show you the whole thing and then do a close up. And here's Ben Kenobi, the young Ben Kenobi. freaking mandalas. <laughs> That's really light pencil I did. Oh, that one turned out decent. And then this I was just experimenting with pen. Colored pens. Let's see. Shoot the whole shot there. And then go in for details. Here 
Yoda. Love the way Yoda turned out. More mandala type. <laughs> I think this is the last one I did. That one turned out decent. left off there so I'll show you a few other pages I am mm, probably a fourth into this book more mandalas a lot of R2-D2s let's see what else do we have here Lando I forgot his name it's on the tip of my stretch of this he's uh is that um, Job of the Hutt's little pet. Oh, that's cool. Oh, Alec Guinness. That's cool. Very cool. Okay. And that's what I've been working on so far. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe, like, catch you later.